and maybe you can uh, think about an introduction later. Yeah, later. I remember even when attending school, I think I found history particularly interesting because it seemed to allow me to contextualize problems that were current in the present. It is possible to teach history apart from politics. I think the short answer to this is no. Uh, nationalism continues to be a relevant force shaping our time. Mm -hmm. uh, do you think that historians fail in this particular enterprise to weaken the nationalism? Yeah, I think uh, part of the problem of many uh, social democratic or socialist parties in Europe is that they have uh, become or are at least seen in the eyes of many of those socially marginalized people part of the establishment. Yeah, yeah, no, I agree. Yes, I think again, I mean, my limited perception of Brazil is also that it is a society that uh, tolerates enormous differences in uh, social uh, inequality, um, but it is also a society in which, um, and I may be wrong there, but in my perception, uh, large parts of the middle classes uh, have no um, consciousness of uh, the value of um, um, welfare and social equality for the benefit of society as a whole. Because, it, well, I think it will maybe you change the subject. It's not the center of a conversation here. It may be uh, a little polemic. Yeah, we're not sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we can discuss about this later. Okay. Well, <laughs> and then later we are going to do an introduction to... Do you have plans to go to Brazil? Uh, no, we need it once, I think. I'd like to work on this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you very much also for a set of Thank you. questions. And